Chuck Liddell? I was like, are you are you kidding me? You met Chuck Liddell today? Yeah, he had a mohawk, and everybody said that he was rich. I didn't understand why. <laughs> <laughs> Sadrith Mora. What? Wolverine yeah. Holland, Sadrith Mora? Oh, that's like, you can teleport there too, but it's kind of far away. <laughs> I don't really suggest it. Oh, then that means that, yeah, I only got quests now that are far away. Or you could try hooking up with Rudder and That's right, it's in this town, right? What can I help you? Yeah, we yeah, can do in, that. It's in the big crab shell looking building. Ah. That's what they call it. They all look like crab shells. But it's in the big one. <laughs> the big one, okay. <laughs> uh, who else am I uh, yeah, my sister's also seen Mark McGuire, who she didn't know who that was. Uh, Did she say he looked awfully like roided up <laughs> <laughs> this was after he retired so she didn't oh. yeah but she, she was like this this guy with the uh, orange hair came in everybody knew who he was i'm like who she's like mark mcguire and i'm like you met mark mcguire yeah there's a ginger yeah dude <laughs> i thought he had brown hair no he's always had red hair with oh. the brown goatee no. and all that no wonder why everybody hated him. It's <laughs> on steroids. Uh, he was what he was like the first guy to get caught ever. But of course, like I don't know, there were all these rules. Maybe it wasn't illegal, but I'm kind of like, if they're telling me it's illegal, I'm gonna assume it was. Uh, no, how's Red around? Oh, the big one. Ah, that's the big one. But um, oh, and then when I've gone to to. BlizzCon. I met uh, the the senior. Uh, oh man, I can't f remember his title. Met uh, Chris Madsen there. Oh yeah. Uh, uh, What's he do? He is basically in charge of all the creative content of Blizzard. Oh cool. He uh, he opened up one. I think year. you just go straight into that one, the important looking one with three yeah. doors. <laughs> There we go. Did you, did you happen to see that their their unveiling of Diablo three? I there for that? did. I was there for that one in, I think it was two. So well, at least the the 2010 one, and then I was there for Mr. Pandaria, but I don't play that game. But it was I, when they did it, I I was laughing. I was like, "There's no way that's real." Okay. What the hell but is Mr. Pandaria? It's a new World of Warcraft expansion where you can play as a panda. Instead that of sounds let's hear it. <laughs> like MMO stuff to me. It I is. I it is an MMO, but yeah, when I'm, I'm like, so instead of an orc or a, or an elf or a human, I could be a panda. It's just you let's know, like it. that's the thing they always do. Like, what are we gonna do to get all of these kids? You know, <laughs> they're they're like watching all these animes, <laughs> and you know, what are we gonna do? Well, we gotta have something cute. What uh, about a panda? <laughs> 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 they, they they went for it. I, I'm I hear a lot of people are excited about it. That's not me. Like I, uh, whatever. I'm not a big MMO fan either. Like if <laughs> I'm gonna grind, I might want to grind for something with a storyline. <laughs> <laughs> there is a surprising amount of story in MMOs, but nobody cares. <laughs> I I played it. Um, I I I was using somebody's account when they weren't playing it. And I got my character up to, to level 80, which was maximum at the time. And I couldn't tell you a damn thing about the plot of that game. That, like, who, who'd you fight? I have no idea. <laughs> uh, oh, you mean the big dragon dude? Oh, yeah, I kicked his ass. I was kind of rushing. <laughs> uh, geez. Where, where is I somebody that I can talk to to join? Let's go to the council entrance. I guess. I think you like had it in that first part of that court looking door that you walk through. There's a lady up front. I think you were just supposed to talk to her. I don't know what you've been doing in the meantime. <laughs> Meandering about. I am looking for something because all I see are guards. No, there was a lady up front. Like, oh, geez. the first place that I was? Yeah. Ah, that would make yeah. too much sense. No, I'm looking for the guy in the back. That's just like, oh, you can join here. Oh, sweet. I, I, don't I did like talk to too close to her, like higher <laughs> ups for some reason. Everybody's all secretive. Guard, my patience is limited. 
Uh, no. Won't let me join, it doesn't look like. Really? Speak with Naminda in the council hall. Okay. Oh, never mind. I guess you were supposed to be in the council hall. <laughs> oh, they did announce, speaking of BlizzCon, that there's not going to be a BlizzCon in 2012. I'm very disappointed about that. Because it's literally down the street. That's how I kept going. <laughs> so, yeah, gonna that's, miss that's out kind of a it. bummer. Yeah. Oh, there's somebody down here. Uh, everybody says it's because they don't have a anything to announce or anything like that. Yeah. I want to join. How do I join House Redoran? No, you're... Oh, Naminda. And they're all pissy at me. Why are you pissy? Because you're not a Dunmer. <laughs> you're not. You're not one of those drow ripoffs. <laughs> Where? I'm trying to join. Is if you guys wanted more people in, you'd make it easier to join. But no, practice room. I doubt she's in the practice room. That's the way I came in. Hmm. Uh, where's Naminda? Can you ask about Naminda? Or is that they said that she was in this room, actually. Gals, like, they're just going a big circle. I think I did. Okay, let's. Do you. Wh will you tell me where Naminda is? I've been lost way too many times this session. Naminda. No. She uh, she doesn't Let's have it. it there. Okay, so we're, I have a feeling we're very close to Naminda. <laughs> I can feel her presence around here she's, somewhere. She's like breathing down your neck, man. <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure those are the guards, actually. Get off my yeah, case, guards. <laughs> actually, these isn't. ones aren't too bad. It's those ordinators that in the back that are always <laughs> trolling you. And, Better not slip up, or I'm gonna read you the vibe or whatever <laughs> they say. Uh, there's the hostel where I could just sleep. If you were okay, there's a problem with these mods. Okay, uh, yeah, sorry. There's nobody in this hostel, but they're still playing the voices as if it's full. <laughs> Which is fine, you know, it kind of adds to it, but. Yeah. No, dude. It's the Alhambra like architecture. It, <laughs> it carries all the sound around. Oh, uh, come on, M Naminda, help me out. I wish there was like a shout function in this game. <laughs> uh, actually, there was a th there was a thing in uh, in WoW that I loved. You had to download it as a mod, but it was the best thing ever, and it was called Quest Helper. You could put it That's to the it. little corner of your screen and it would have this giant arrow telling you where you needed to go at all times. That would be, like, much appreciated <laughs> in this game. Like, because why, I... Why, I why hasn't somebody come up with that yet? <laughs> it, it would be a good mod. It would be an awesome mod and I would have it and I'd be using it instead of going up and looking at every door going, where's Naminda? I'm going to have to go into one of these houses eventually, or one of these rooms. I'll okay, I choose you, Goris and Drello. Where is Naminda? Are you Naminda? Okay, I'll land it, but make, it, make quick. it quick. I'm looking to join. Speak in the council hall. I want to join House Redoran. Speak with her in the council hall. Can you be more specific? Like, seriously, this whole thing is the council hall. And all there are three guards and that lady over there in the corner. Well, I guess from the perspectives of the developers of this game, they had come a long way since Ultima 1. <laughs> <laughs> it is a long way. Uh, I've tried to play Ultima 1. Me too. I, I mean, tried. <laughs> like, they don't hold your hand at all. Like, <laughs> no. Go for it. I made it I made it I think about an hour in before I'm like I'm sorry I can't do this. <laughs> Speak with her. Yeah. Come on. I hear that seven's supposed to be the best though. Although yeah. like if you don't play four through six, then you don't get any of the backstory. <laughs> so what's the point? You know? Exactly. It's 
Uh, yeah, go go to seven. That, and I would feel bad if I did play Ultima if I didn't know any of the any of the stuff from the previous games. But that's just me. I know, because like if I was to play Dragon Warrior, I might skip all of them and just start with eight because that's the one that I did, and I loved it. And that's what got me really into the games. But I would I would feel the need to start with. Uh, with Dragon Warrior One, speak traveler, which Even is which is like older than Final Fantasy One, <laughs> and they really don't hold your hand. Just go, and as soon as you it, you can walk on mountains, but there's higher level enemies on there. So as soon as you step on a mountain, you're yeah, you're just all of a sudden in a fight with something that you did not know existed. Okay. You know what I. I played fa the original Fantasy Star for the Sega Mega System, or you know, before ah, the Genesis. Right. And that one was actually good. I was like, damn, like this holds up. I liked. But I tried. Yeah. I liked Fantasy Star. Did you ever play Fantasy Star Online? No, I only played wow. yeah the first two I think, because I had Game Tap, and on Game Tap it was free once you once you purchased it. Huh. I've got better things yeah, to do apparently a lot of people have no idea about GameTap. You've heard of that, haven't you? No, I haven't. Basically, you go download it. It was like a, a beta of, of Steam, what that is now. Uh, you could download some of their games. And um, then you could purchase the, the new games. Um, so, you, like, that's where that's I could play uh, the original Myst and then a couple of the, f the newer ones. But then... Uh, they ended up coming up with their own mist, and you had to pay like ten bucks for that. But there were so many games on there, and it was like, uh, I think it rounded out to about three dollars a month if you bought a year subscription to it. Huh? Okay, I'm just cool. leaving. I'm just leaving this. <laughs> I I am so done looking in there. Is there anywhere else I can go? No. Are you? You're I not in. Something. You're no, out here. What the hell, Maminda? <laughs> what the hell, Joy? Yes, I want to join. What are the rules? Do not steal from your kin. Strike your kin unprovoked. Or murder your kin. Do not break your word. Fine, whatever. I'm in. Yeah. Can I a advance? Of red guards. <laughs> uh, sh are having with mud. <sighs> I have to kill mud crabs. At least I get to kill stuff. Oh, Go west. And go kill mud crabs. That I can do. I don't have to find anything. 